Channel. Episode 4 of our podcast is live now and we're going to play you a sample of it here in this video. All the links for where you can listen to and download our podcasts are in the description box below this video. If you enjoy these free podcasts, we'd love you to leave us a rating and review in iTunes. That would really help us out. Today's episode is part of our Ask TVC series where we take one of your juicy questions and answer and discuss it in depth. Yeah, if you'd like to take part in this series, you can leave us a question at thatvegancouple.com in the comments section under the notes for this podcast. The link is in the description below this video. Today's question is a very personal one and it was actually quite an emotional and in parts difficult podcast for us to record. The question was about our relationship. How do we make it work? How have we overcome our struggles and how do we make each other better? Great questions. Here's just a short sample of our in-depth answer. Thanks for listening, guys, and you can hear the full podcast at the links in the description box. Enjoy, and see you in the next video. I mean, I can't recall now, but I was probably subconsciously thinking, oh, no, it's, you know, it, like it's me. You know, I, yeah. there's something I've done. There's something I'm doing that I'm the problem, yeah. you know, and that's an uncomfortable feeling. Oh, it would be awful. I'm sorry about <laughs> no, that. No, no, but no. I'm sorry that, you know, you were feeling the way you were feeling because I can, you know sympathize with yeah, it yeah so that was on a thursday night and i had to go to work on friday uh and yeah we still hadn't spoken i got home friday night and i thought right i'm just going to get home i sat on the couch i got out the bottle of wine as we usually did and i just uh i started drinking and i started writing what i needed to say i just got everything out of my head and out of my heart on that piece of paper and then you came home from work, opened the door, and there's your wife sitting on the couch with a bottle of red. I'm laughing gone. now, but it wasn't funny. It at wasn't the time. funny. It was it was awful. And uh, you sat down. You're still in your suit. And I just gave you the piece of paper. And um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, we haven't yeah. spoken about this in a long time. No, long long. We've we've worked through it and moved on. Yeah, and it's so yeah, kind of hard to bring up all the um, yeah. yeah it's a bit yucky but no it's it's good to discuss to um help other people to help other people that's the the um objective of the podcast yeah, isn't it that's right so um okay get it together girl <laughs> <laughs> i gave you the piece of paper did i read it to you i don't think so i think you just read it to yourself okay i can't remember i don't know how that was it. possible because my writing is absolute like chicken scribble and i was semi drunk at the time so i don't know how you got the details in, but you did in <laughs> fact it. knowing now how intelligent chickens are i'm pretty sure their <laughs> scribble would be better than yours <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I can't even read my own handwriting. And uh, and you read it and you read it and you read it. And it was just explaining everything to you of how I felt and what was going on. And basically, I gave you an ultimatum you on did. that day. You did. I yeah. said to you, this is what I'm doing from this point. I'm going in this direction. I need to do these things in my life. You either sort your stuff out and come with me or it's over. Yeah. It came to that. It did. And that sounds so harsh saying it now. And people listening might think, oh, my God, how could you say that? You didn't give him a second chance. And I did give you a second chance. I said, sort your stuff out and come with me. Exactly. Or that's it. Yeah. So, yeah, that's where it got to. Yeah. <laughs> you want to take over? So I then <laughs> went to the same hypnotherapist. and we You called her the next morning, actually. Well, and she to. was expecting your call. And I'm she was like... <gasps> I'm glad you called, Luca. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was given, you know, the most important ultimatum of my life and, you know, I needed to take action. Can uh, I ask you a question, though? I don't yes. know if I've ever asked you this. All right. This is an <laughs> exclusive. <laughs> did you, did any thought come into your mind at that point of...